Hey guys, it's Ruben Tatin and I'm back with another video. Today we'll be heading out to a new place to try some Japanese food. Me and my partner will be heading to Fujiwara Tofu Shop. Um, so that place is mainly based off Initial D, which is like that manga anime. Um, both of us have not really like watched it before, but we're always looking for new places to go for our dates. So today we're going to do like a little food vlog and like review the food. Um, thankfully, we managed to book it at 50% off because there's this like app where if you go at a certain timing, we're going at like 5 p.m. Um, we can get half price off, so that's pretty good. Yeah, so let's get to the video. <laughs> First dish, we ordered this crab stick salad with natari coco. I quite like crab stick salad, but I didn't expect them to have natari coco, so I decided to try it. And honestly, I thought it was really nice. I like that sweet taste with the crab stick salad was really good, and I would recommend it. are like three of my favorite things combined so I definitely ordered it. It's one of my comfort foods I would say. For the third dish, we ordered this ama ebi karage, which is this deep fried sweet shrimp. Honestly, it wasn't that great, it was kind of like average, but my partner wanted to try it, and we both like shrimp, but this wasn't really that good, maybe because it was a bit oily. Yeah, so don't really recommend it. Next, we got this kake gudon. I found that it was a little salty but still good. And for a drink, we got this panda chueno, which is gula malaka soy milk with crushed jelly and jelly bubble. I found that this drink was really nice. It had a Singaporean vibe to it, so kind of nostalgic. I used to drink crushed jelly a lot. And here we are, breaking apart our chopsticks and digging into the food. We were debating whether to order more food or not, but overall the experience was really good. Um, it could be because there's basically nobody at this point of time, and we just had the whole place to ourselves. Yeah, the food was really good, and I would say I would come here again. Next, we got this chicken karagi don. And at this point, we both realized we ordered too much food. Maybe because we ordered two oily dishes, it left a little bit of a bad aftertaste, but overall still good. And now, 
I saw some birds on the way back home and I also saw some fishes and what's that shop called? Is it Colleen's? Like a random restaurant we passed by. Hey guys, so that brings us to the end of visiting Fujiwara Tofu Concept Shop Singapore. Me and my partner Technically, me, like I wanted to get these stickers, so <laughs> I was like, hey, can you take one for me? Because they said, you can get a free one, but you can only take one, so I was like, go take one for me. <laughs> so I have to be cool stickers. Um, I really enjoyed my experience there. I really liked that we had the whole place lost shelves. It felt like it was like our personal room. <laughs> but yeah, I, I recommend visiting there. Um, maybe at night, I guess at night you might be able to catch one of those cars that is advertised or like associated with the place. Um, total we spent about $30 but it is because we have 50% off which is why it was cheaper for us. So do feel free to check out the shop. Um, the stuff was nice and the boss is nice too. Um, I'm thinking of trying new places like this and if you guys like the vlog then feel free to comment places to visit and if you guys like me to do voiceovers yeah uh, thank you guys so much for watching and stay tuned for the next video bye bye